so guys here is my palm kernel oil unrefined okay now that's my lye solution that's my foam booster you can call it foaming agent that's my silicate and here is my calcium carbonate powder and that's my fragrance oil and of course we need a soap mold to work with all right so we're just going to be pouring in our calcium carbonate into the oil okay and i stir it very well very very well to ensure that the powder is evenly distributed to avoid any form of white patches on the soap so you stir it in very very well until you do not see any more of the powder hanging in the oil so now I had to guard up myself for just going to be pouring in our light solution into our oils please while doing this make sure you have your protective gears on so you stir up the oil just a little bit more to make sure that there's no hanging powder in there then here goes our light solution into the oil as I pour I stir this is best done when you are actually using your own homemade palm kernel oil unrefined please and you stir it in vigorously very very well then the next goes my silicate yes you stir it there's something i always mention please stirring is the key in soap production you have to learn how to stir now I'm just adding my foaming agent. Yes, and I'm gonna stir. You have to stir until you notice that your batter is smooth enough try as much as possible to stir like focus <laughs> you just have to okay so i'm gonna be adding my fragrance oil now then i stir don't mind me i just try to make sure that not even a drop is wasted <laughs> I stir it in very well. Mmm, it smells so good already. Okay guys, so the next thing I'm going to be doing is to pour it into our soap mold. So I bring that closer and I just stir a little more to make sure that I am perfect, <laughs> that my batter is good to go. Please, it is best to pour it into your mold at medium trace because once it gets thicker, it might actually give you troubles when pouring it into your mold. try to scrape off guys I don't like to waste I try to scrape it real good Okay. 
Okay, I'm just gonna be cleaning up my mold a bit. Just to make sure that it needs to your eyes. <laughs> Alright. Trust me, I try to make sure that every drop of this soap gets in. <laughs> Because I always imagine if I let it be in that cup, it's gonna waste. And you don't know how much grams of soap that would have made for me. <laughs> don't mind me, that's just me. Okay, so I'm gonna just leave it there to set. And once it's ready, I'm gonna come back to show it to you. Oh, beautiful. Here we are, guys. Yes, our soap is, our soap is ready to be unmolded. So I'm just going to pop it out of the mold. Mmm, this gave me tough time to pop out. I really do not know why. Just a word of advice. I think it's best you also oil your wooden mold. I mean, what you're supposed to put your silicone inside. <laughs> okay, there goes our beautiful laundry bar so smooth and shiny and tell me what else could you please want from a laundry bar that you won't find in this smooth easy going recipe that doesn't give you trouble <laughs> so that's a beautiful bar so I'm just gonna cut this up into bars and I'm gonna bring it back to show it to you okay here we are I've cut it up and I've stamped it yes there we go gel them to the world yes that's me that's us <laughs> okay so guys thank you so much for watching God bless you all bye